Hey folks, it's Lanso90 here, and welcome back to Let's Play Slasher's Keep. Just taking us up to floor three here. Let's press enough, but apparently it wasn't working. But there we go. Okay. That's one of the mechanical traps that the, the other thing was telling us about. Yeah, great. You're going to be hard to kill. Unless we do that. Things are getting slightly harder to kill. Especially when there's a buffer like this. So try to use spikes a little bit more often. Yes, I do know that it heals them too, but if we're tossing them in the spikes, it doesn't matter how much health they have. So we would like to keep the combos going, however, it's a little bit harder on floor three. Oh, there's the exit. Too bad we need the XP. The game does pause when you have... Well, the game doesn't pause, but your street pauses when you have your thing open. There's something we needed here, right? No. Yes. Yes, no. <laughs> I hate it when I'm the path up to these guys. Is... This weapon doesn't pair well with uh, Repost, but that's okay. It's locked to the weapon, so it's not like we'll be stuck with this forever, because eventually this weapon won't be good enough. Same as the others, though, with the... Please die. Alright, let's make sure we don't step on traps while we're trying to speedrun kills. And make sure we don't loop back. Unfortunate. Couldn't keep this combo going. That's okay. Need every level up we can get our hands on. that that did not kill the moth. You see, this is the slightly slower shooter, and you can just about barely get through it. So you can understand why the second floor, having one that's a little bit faster, and then having two of the faster ones shooting at each other, is basically unavoidable. I came into the spikes. Okay. Score the XP, bro. Oh. There's food in here. We don't have to pop a potion or anything. Just a very dangerous room. clearing the map, then we can go back and loot. Ah, the forge, okay. We get four things. Like the flower. <laughs> Probably blows 6%. 
Sorry, there was 4%. It's definitely going to be this one. And then... this one's actually better huh this moldier or however you spell it I never remember what it's not very good <laughs> the and not very good. It must have been a very old hammerhead that we sent back. I thought it was a pretty good one, but I guess it was good when we found it, huh? I should have sent back the other one that I found, I guess. That was weird. benefit they get from healing I don't think is nearly as painful as the benefit we get from healing. Even though it heals them more. It's just uh, any kind of healing at all on the second floor is fantastic. Because there's guys like these guys that we can just parry all day. If we need to. We are out of things to kill officially, so let's get back to the corner and level up. 23s across the board. Okay. Start breaking pots. Heavy duty thing. It's a mace head. I will hold on to it. All right, let's use our disassembler ability, I suppose. Unless money's worth more to us now, but... Hold on. <laughs> How does this work? I just need to disassemble melee weapons. That... Do we do it over here? a waste of a skill point. <laughs> it's not very good. Not very good. Just don't fall into the pit because that will kill us. and that is worth our time. <laughs> Alright, this room, another chest. Melee knockback. These are all decorative. They don't really do anything. Don't need two mace heads. aren't worth too much for me. I'd rather have a shaft weapon. Like the sword isn't gonna not gonna be effective for very much longer. The only thing of value in it is the fact that it's blessed. Oops, uh, don't need that really. I suppose it will come in handy if we ever get like a special like a really good wand. It's just not very common. We need like the shotgun one. Shotgun one's real good. Okay. This tiny room. 
Master, now bowed before him. The God of Fire is it moot? I mean, he burned to death. Okay, we can do that. Because the uh, spider boss technically burns to death. Something else. I guess I can put on... I can put on the starburst weapon and give us starburst. However, I think putting on Molnir and taking fiery fire damage is worth more. Because now we'll do fire damage with any weapon we have, and we have bonus fire damage from Pyromancy. It's a two for one combo. Alright, how do we clear this room out here? Da, da, da. Potion. Once you start getting these size of potions, that means you're that basically means you're ready for the second set of floors in a sense. Alright, we are gonna go this way first though. Check that that end. Might as well save. that wand to sell. All right. Don't step on the trap. Keep on jumping. Bunny hop. that okay Get some pots up here boxes up here hey an extra bomb Take it. Fire damage will also allow us to have a way to damage th things over time when we're just st sitting there parrying. Yeah, I guess it heals them too, so maybe not. Never mind. Okay, I think we're good to go now. Yeah, we're good to go now. Okay. This way. Alright, time for the boss. We're not sending anything back this time. Hello, Sorry, I'm all near. You know, I won't use that myself. Now you're still interesting because Starburst is pretty good. Crit 1% is just pathetic. Melee speed that much is okay. Max deal is 0.4%, not worth very much. Really, this much fire damage is not worth a ton, but I don't know. Might as well keep it, I suppose. All right, level 50, armor 54 armor, 10 strength, artisan repost. We'll buy it just because it's so good. I forgot that our melee leg our leggings actually were okay, but we'll put those on all the same. Uh, all right, spider killing time. Almost 
kill the spider traditionally easy enough, huh? I don't want to parry in this situation. Do not want to accidentally heal her. I thought you can parry. Oops, got stuck. So, gentlemen, we got her. Coins, healing elixir, everything else. Okay, armor 37. Sword speed, Arcanist blue blooded. I think that's worth it. That sucks. Heavy blows, 200. It's a lot of damage, but that other weapon on the ground is even better, I'm sure. Range not back, fiery shots. Eh. Now, the ice magic wand is pretty good. That's the shotgun, I think. This one's the bonuses are so good that it's hard to justify. The exterminator. Absolute bucket loads of damage. It's slow. Blessed weapon. I guess we can just keep this around as a healing item, right? We can just whip it out as we need it. You know what? This is a good time to use this. Turn all that good stuff into things. Do have a very good mace head here. That'll be a fantastic item if we can build that into a weapon. Might as well keep these on us to sell. You better not be blocking the door. I'd be very upset if your body was blocking the door. All right. Okay, now it's saved. I guess I had to go forward through the door and then we would have saved uh we'll hold it here i think i hope you all enjoyed if you did remember to hit the like button keep the conversation going in the comments and subscribe if you want to see more until next time hope you have a good day